Hi guys, in this video we are going to look at the Lewis structure for N2O. It's a chemical formula for dinitrogen oxide and for knowing the structure of this molecule we are first going to look at the total number of valence electrons followed by the possible Lewis structures for this molecule and we will then find out formal charges for atoms to find out which one is the most suitable Lewis structure. So N2O has a total of 16 valence electrons because nitrogen has 5 valence electrons in its outer shell. Uh, so it has 10 and oxygen has 6 so we have a total of 16 valence electrons now there are three possible uh, Lewis structures for this molecule as you can see here there are double bonds in this structure for this uh, Lewis structure there is one single bond and one triple bond and the other structure is also kind of similar because it also has one triple bond and one single bond to find out which one of these is the most suitable or the relevant structure we are going to calculate the formal charges for all atoms in the structures so starting with this uh, Lewis structure right here you can see that nitrogen has five valence electrons out of which four are non-bonding ones and four are bonding ones which means it has a total formal charge of minus one for this nitrogen there are five valence electrons out of which zero are non-bonding you can see how it has uh, used up all its electrons to form bonds five are bonding ones and it has a charge of plus one oxygen here will have a charge of zero because there are six valence electrons out of which four are non-bonding and four are bonding so uh, similarly we are going to follow this process for all the structures over here for this uh, structure and for this structure as well you can do the calculations using the formal charge calculator or you can use the formula that we have shown here and by doing that you will find out that this structure in the structure this nitrogen atom will have a charge of minus two this nitrogen atom will have a charge of plus one and oxygen will have a charge of plus one for the third lowest structure the the formal charge on this nitrogen atom will be zero the formal charge for this nitrogen atom will be plus one and for oxygen it will be minus one so now you might wonder how are we going to uh, select or choose which one is the most relevant structure for n2o so uh, the the rule that we follow in uh, lewis structure is to find out a structure in which charges are as uh, near to zero as possible so by doing that we can rule out this second option because there is a charge of minus two on nitrogen atom so you can rule out this possibility now secondly uh, we also check that the most electronegative atom should have the charge because it is the electronegative atom that is the atom that will try to pull electrons towards itself so uh, the electronegative atom should have a minus charge and here as you can see that this uh, in this structure oxygen has uh, in this Lewis structure oxygen has a minus one charge so this is the most relevant structure or suitable structure for N2O and hence you can write the Lewis structure for dinitrogen oxide like this and this is the most acceptable Lewis structure as well and um, yeah so this is the Lewis structure for N2O for more videos on polarity, molecular geometry, hybridization and dual structure of molecules. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.